Well, g'day everybody and welcome back to Planet Crafter. We are sitting at uh, 54.67% on uh, on uh, the next stage, which is trees. Uh, we've got stuff climbing up steadily, but not fast enough for my liking. I did send a GPS satellite up. I just wanted to see what it was like. There really is no point in it. Everybody was correct. What I want to do, <clears throat> uh, I want to concentrate on, uh, what have we got? We've, we've got everything unlocked there. Uh, we need a nuclear fusion generator, uh, which is going to require extra heat. But I want to unlock the tree spreader. 7.5 ppm. So, 7.5 ppm is going to be, uh, that's oxygen, isn't it? Yeah, oxygen. So we're going to need to concentrate on uh, perhaps putting some extra oxygen stuff out um, for now. Now. To do that, I think, I still think that the algae generator is the best for oxygen, I do believe. Um, I, I have been uh, drinking out of lakes, which is absolutely awesome. I've been continuing on, continuing on with the DNA stuff as well, sort of prepping for that. Um, so we're going to probably look today at a T4 heater and uh algae algae another algae generator a t2 algae generator i reckon just to boost that oxygen up as much as we possibly uh hang on flower spreaders give us that's 350 and that's 325 um these take plastics and magnesium and fertilizer so i think we'll throw a couple of these down uh, that's two plastics, two super alloy, magnesium. That's two super alloy. We don't need plastics for that, and they do 325. Flower spreaders might be a little bit better to throw down, to be honest. All right, so to do that, we need... Uh, I have been doing a little bit of resource gathering and all that type of stuff, but uh, not as much as I would like to. I had a... Uh, a storm a super alloy storm thank you to everybody who's making the who's uh who's sort of making comments and giving me suggestions and stuff and letting me know what's going on um the super alloy you do need to collect that very very quickly very very quickly because it does disappear and it disappears pretty bloody quick too i must say uh water bottles is no worries we'll get some of those plants we are going to we've got a golden seed there and probably a tusker i think uh got a golden seed out of one of the things that i did we need uh four of those uh what do we have oh i've still got that sitting i've still got that golden effigy sitting in there found another golden crate believe it or not for now i am going to put that down there and we can pick it up again later all right flower spreaders here we go uh haven't got anything out of the gas extractor for a while either so we probably should do that and collect that stuff uh i think we might throw i'm just going to continue on out here i reckon just going to continue on out here we'll throw you in there and we will throw another one just over here as well and we'll throw those in and that's going to help us with our uh it's going to help us with our oxygen and it's going to bring our oxygen levels up and hopefully unlock that tree spreader rocket once we get to a certain amount there so that should be pretty cool um i've got uh everything else is going very very well at the moment actually to be honest so uh, i'll show you what we've got in uh resource wise we do have four rockets sitting here i got two um, I actually got two rockets in um, uh, in a inside some crates actually inside some crates that I found. Uh, we've got another two there. There is our nuclear fusion generator. This is what we are looking at. Okay, so we've unlocked that. So that's going to take five pulsar quartz and four super alloy. That's not much at all, to be honest, because we can actually we can make pulsar quartz, can't we? We can make it. We already have a few. How do we make pulsar quartz? Let's have a look. Let's open that up. We've got two sitting here. I thought we had more than that. Must. 
I actually thought we had more. Uh, we've got nothing sitting in there, and we've got uh, a full thing there. Let's have a look in here. Uh, pulsar quartz takes osmium, uranium, zeolite, and yep, okay. And what do we need to build one? We needed four, didn't we? Uh, we need three more. We need three more. Okay, so we can get uh, one, two, three of those. Uh, we can get one, two, three of those. Uh, one, two, three of those, and one, two, three of those. All right, beautiful. This is gonna, uh, this is gonna help us hugely. Absolutely, absolutely, massively. So uh, now, we do, now all we need is four super alloy. All right, that's a bit of a bonus. Two, three, four. Now I'm. One thing that concerns me greatly about um, about uh, doing stuff off of camera is that um, we tend to sort of, if I do stuff off camera, I kind of feel like there could be things that you guys miss out on. But then there's a lot of resource gathering and stuff to do off camera as well. So, uh, so I kind of do a little bit of that as well. Uh, Let's grab some of those. I'm not sure how many we're actually going to need, so we might grab a few more. There we go. It's not like we don't have heaps. I was thinking um, at the at the drills and stuff like that. I was thinking of the possibility at the drills of um, of uh, actually putting shredders. If we put shredders at the, at some of the drills, um, some of the excess resources that we actually get out of it. Um, would probably go well to be shredded so um, because we do get quite a considerable amount although I do I do try and keep my cupboards stocked as well like my storage containers stocked as well so um, whether or not that's a good idea for that I'm not sure exactly how big this thing is guys let's get another one up there and let's have a look how big this nuclear reactor is I'm wondering whether it's nuclear f what the hell it's it's that small what does that generate 1835 as opposed to 300 what the hell holy moly that's a huge difference just that tiny little thing there wow hello hello Hello, hello. Let's go on. Uh, what we should do, actually, what, what I think would be a really good idea is if we, um, uh, if we build ourselves a table, a desktop out here, or maybe, maybe we could even build ourselves one of these. Just a little room off of here somewhere that we could actually monitor, that we could actually monitor what's going on with our power while we're out here where the power is, so... We're going to do that. Let's, uh, of course, there's always titanium around. Except for when you want the bloody stuff. Okay, we're going to need some more of that. And we're going to need... We might as well get three. Uh, we're going to need ourselves a bit of... A uh, bit of silicon as well, I think. If we can find any. It's all looking pretty damn fine out here, isn't it? Like, it's all looking really, really good. A little bit more iron. Right there. Maybe we can build ourselves a, um, just a little place off the top of this, so. Let's see, where will we build it? We can build it probably here, I reckon. Maybe right there would be a good place to build it and just for uh, for aesthetics sake we will throw that in there as well so all right lovely we should have enough to build a door as well perfect and I think in here what we'll do is we will uh, we'll build ourselves a desk what are we going to need for that a couple of iron for a desk oh I can hear rain out there guys I can hear rain out there We've got that, and the other thing that we can build is a power screen. Uh, silicon, magnesium, and iron. We'll go and, go and grab some. Silicon, magnesium, and iron. There is our uh, magnesium. 
It's a lovely day. It's a lovely day. It's raining. Uh, silicon. And iron. That should be enough to build that, shouldn't it? Uh, where are we? That one there. Yep, perfect. Alright, at some point we may want to connect these somehow too. I'm not sure whether height-wise they're going to connect. That's probably where we're going to have the problem, really. Let's head in here and we will throw a power screen on here and we should be able to we should be able to at any point in time see how much power we need and at the moment we have a crap load a crap load all right what's happening with the oxygen now let's go and have a really quick squeeze of that and then we might do a little bit of housekeeping um do, 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 do. Oxygen. Uh, yep, it's going up pretty quickly. Pretty quickly. Uh, we've done that one. So we can uh, actually put that seed over here. Put that tree seed over there. Oh, is that where we were putting all of our tree seeds? No, it's not. Where was I storing all of those? Uh, down here. Yeah. Uh huh. That's where you're storing them. Okay, we need another tree bark and another mutagen for that. Uh, let's see, terraformation. Pressure is probably something that we need to look at. And uh, if we have a look in here, we've unlocked all of that. We've unlocked all of that. We've got that to unlock. And we have... Where are we? We've got the uh, T3 tree spreader and the fusion energy cell. And that's all we have to unlock now out of our blueprints. There is a massive update coming out soon. Check this out. Check this out. Well, down we go. Yep. Drink. Drink. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Drinking out of that. Perfect. All right. So, yeah. Massive, massive um, uh, update coming out. Going to need to go and see if we've got any more osmium. And that is due, as far as I'm aware, by the end of next week. So, that's pretty impressive. I'm looking forward to that. It's supposed to be a big update with more caves, uh, more map to explore, and all that type of stuff. So, I think our... Um, was it in here? Yeah, it was in here. I think our um, our playthrough of this has actually, has actually gone well. It's kind of worked in really well, I think. Um, you know, we haven't gone too far in regards to, uh, in regards to having to wait for, for content to come out. It's lovely and purple, isn't it? Um, we haven't, we haven't had to sort of stop playing and wait for, uh, and wait for content to come out, which I think is a really, really good thing because I wouldn't have liked to have powered through a series and, uh, and to end up with, um, with nothing to do basically and waiting for an update to come out so it's going to be pretty good a lot more uh, planet to explore i'm trying to remember somebody said uh, if you remember we found that wall of um we actually found that wall of it's kind of like a sand kind of sulfur wall of sulfur falling down and it kind of looked like the end of the map but somebody said that i should explore in there so we're probably going to that yet. Uh, let's sort that out. Let's sort this stuff out. We'll throw these in here. Uh, we'll just get rid of a pile of this stuff, guys. Uh, that is full, so the titanium's going to have to go in here, unfortunately. With all of our rocket parts. Uh, cobalt, yep, there's three of those that we got out of that drill. Aluminium, there's none there. Osmium. Osmium is a very important thing to have. Iron, perfect. And magnesium. There we go. All right, lovely. Might throw the uh, spare oxygen bottle in here. Like so. And we probably need to go down and check this and probably collect everything out of that. Yes, there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of water down there. A lot of water. All right. Uh, that can go in here as well. And we'll drink one. Don't need to take any water with us anymore. Uh, all right. P 
Perfect. Perfect. It is all going up. We need to collect some tree bark as well, which is probably at the point where it needs to be collected, and it is. So I've been throwing that in here as well with the uh, with the methane cartridges. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Now, next thing that we need to do is we need to increase, we probably want to increase our heat a little bit more. And we could probably throw another one of those down, you know. I don't think it'd hurt, would it? We could start sort of removing some of the older stuff. That might be a pretty good plan. Might be a pretty good plan. I don't think there's anything else that we really want to build at the moment. Um, the shredding machines, yeah, might be a good idea. The recycling machines break down other objects into their core stuff. Not sure whether we actually have stuff that's worthwhile. The other thing is, guys, <laughs> the other thing is, I didn't, um, I haven't, um, I haven't found anywhere near the amount of crates that I need to be finding. Uh, golden crates, I mean. So, um, we're probably going to have to have a look for some of those as well. Uh, I might put a light out here. I'm just doing a little bit of decorating now. There we go. Just a little bit of decorating out here. We'll do a little bit of decorating out here as well. Uh, there, we'll throw uh, we'll throw a light in here as well, which will be pretty cool. That should light that up. Might actually change this light to green. No, to purple now that it's a reactor. That'll be nice. I can't believe this tiny little thing has given us so much power in comparison to these big fellas. Uh, plenty of room for that. Plenty of room for that. All right, so uh, let's not get distracted, Simmy. Well, it's easy to get distracted in this game. The other thing that I want to do is I do want to do some... Uh, I do want to... I want to make a bedroom... I need to make a bedroom up here. I really do. I'm thinking of completely removing this. And, uh, see, the problem is we've got stuff up the top. I was thinking of uh, completely removing it and, uh, and building a big square room in here. The other option is we could build a big square room off of the back of this if it would fit. It would fit and how much is that that's three iron three titanium and two super alloy uh i know it's only it's only sort of it's only dressing it's only sort of set dressing isn't it really uh let's have a look let's get uh let's eat that and grab some water on the way we'll go and empty out some of these uh some of these over here I'm going to do, I, I will, I'll go and do an empty out of, uh, of everything that we have in here and then uh, I will see you when that's all done. Alright, and this is where I think we should be building ourselves a shredding machine. Because I am pretty full on resources and we've got all of that sitting there. So a shredding machine would probably help greatly in that. The other thing is, what do you guys think? Should we be pulling, should I be pulling these smaller drills apart and putting the uh, smaller um, um, ore extractors apart and just putting in T2s everywhere? T2s are a little bit more expensive, but we're not doing too badly on, uh, on materials, so I'm kind of not sure. I'm kind of not sure whether that would be a good idea or not. Let's uh, sort that out. Got some silicon in there. I don't mind keeping full cupboards of certain items, but uh, some of the items we've just got way, way, way too much of. Uh, let's get rid of all of those. As you can see, I think we've got way too much uh, iron and way too much. Uh, eh, it's not too bad because we did use a bit of that, didn't we? I need to take those back. Um, we've got way too much titanium as well. So I might grab those. Kind of a fair bit of sulfur as well, guys. Um, we've got a, an absolute full cupboard there of, of sulfur too. So where's our shredding machine? Right there. 
Uh, let's throw all of that in there. And I was thinking maybe one of these. There we go. One of those next to every uh, next to every single drill thing would probably be a pretty good idea, I think. All right. So now we've got a uh, we've got a drill over here doing some drilling. I'll show you where that is. Because I don't think you guys were here when I did this. When I put this drill over here up. So we'll head over there and have a look at that. Uh, that is doing iridium. Oh, hello. I can spot that from a mile away. I can spot that from a mile away. We'll head up this way. It's the long way around, but it'll do. Yeah, there's still so much that I haven't uh, that I haven't explored on here. Like honestly, it's uh, it's pretty crazy to think of. Ah, um, oh, hello. No, that's not that. I thought that was that uh, thing we were looking at. All right, let's head over here. Should be able to have a drink of water down here. There we go. Lovely. Love it. Love it. Oh, it's looking really nice down here, isn't it? Like, it is looking brilliant. Uh, what are you in there? Yep, grab all of you and we'll disconnect you. There we go, lovely. Found this cave. And in this cave, we've got a storage thing there. In this cave is a T2 drill. Giving us all of that stuff. A whole pile of, uh, of, of iridium. Which is really, really good. I've got a cupboard here that's got some stuff in it as well. Let's get this stuff uh, back to back to the yard, I think. Back to the yard. What are you talking about? You're not at work now, Simi. Let's get it back to our base. Da -da -da. All right, we are back at base. Now, what the hell was I doing back here? My brain is not working. Let's throw some, uh, let's do another couple of those rods. Can only do one of those, but that is fine. Let's uh, sort this stuff out. We'll get this stuff across and that rod across as well. Uh, no more super alloy, but we did get another zeolite, which is really good. All right, we've got, uh, we have plants to collect. Now again, we are running out of uh, we are running out of uh, space storage space for all of this stuff. Way running out of storage space for all of this stuff. So that's gonna be uh, it's gonna be interesting to see what we can do. We've got uh, grown food there. All of this stuff. I think we're gonna have to start. Uh, we're gonna have to start making these mutagens and stuff like that now, uh, just to keep all of this running. I mean, we don't really need to have this stuff running anyway if we don't need it. This stuff here I'm using for food most of the time. Um, I feel like it's sort of the best stuff to, uh, to to eat. It seems to give you, the beans seem to give you the best uh, satiation as well. So, And we've got one of you. Yes, we do. Let's throw that back in there as well. Lovely. Uh, we'll throw those over and we will eat one of those. We'll throw the squash over as well. And the other stuff I've been throwing in here, but we are pretty full. So what we're going to do is make some more stuff up that requires eggplant, uh, which is that. So we need uh, eggplant, sulfur, and algae, and silicon and water. Eggplant, sulfur, and algae. So one, two, three, four of those. Uh, we've got enough of those. We should have enough algae in here. Seven, eight. There we go. Lovely. That'll give us. Uh, that'll give us a little bit of that. Another one, and I don't think. Well, we do have another one in there. Another couple of eggplant. Another three algae. Three. Three. And. And one more sulfur as well. I think so. We'll. Uh, Get some of this done. A little bit of housekeeping. A little bit of housekeeping. And we'll uh, we'll grab ourselves another two of those. Perfect. Those fertilizers can go in the fertilization cupboard, which we're going to need at some point. 
Uh, and the other thing that we need is probably some more water as well. There we go. We'll grab all of that water there. And I can't remember what the other thing was. I can't remember for the life of me what it was. Uh, we need silicon. Okay, so we can do silicon. Excellent. Uh, silicon. Now, what do we got? One, two. So we should have two of those. Uh, we could probably get some more of those, actually. Let's check that out. That's going to give us some more plastics. More mushrooms. We need uh, another four mushrooms. One, two, three, four. And this way, it's uh, it's gonna it's gonna reduce our cupboard space a little bit as well. So we're also going to need to make some more uh, bacteria samples as well, which we can probably do. That's going to give us plastic. There we go, which we kind of don't have enough of as it is. So we've got another two of those. We could probably do. Um, let's see, we could probably do. No, we don't have enough algae, so we can grab some more algae anyway. Uh, all right, perfect. Wow, we're up to seventy-one percent for the next stage, which is actually really, really cool. That's gonna that's gonna happen pretty soon. That is gonna happen pretty soon. Um, now there was one other thing that I wanted to do. Oh, there's a bloody cave down here. You ripper! What's going on in here? Oh, hello. More sulfur. We uh, we got plenty of sulfur. More osmium. This might be a place for a T2 drill. This might be a place for a T2 drill. I'll grab the sulfur while I'm here anyway. Might as well. Uh, osmium would be much better if we could find a heap of osmium. Uh, and hopefully we'll be able to probably mine a little bit more. Where the hell is this going? <gasps> this is actually really cool. This is so cool. Uh, hello. What are you? Uh, oh, yes. Thank you. Uh, don't worry about the aluminium. Take the super alloy. Don't worry about the seed. Not at this point. I want to see how much osmium we can get from here first. May end up having to take all of the sulfur as well. We might have enough room in our inventory. We kind of, kind of do at the moment. This is pretty damn cool, isn't it? Uh, there's another piece up there that we need to get. There we go. Lovely. Well, see, continually exploring, like there's there's things that I just haven't found yet, and this is one of them. This might be a good osmium. Uh, oh, hello, pulsar quartz. Uh, some more of that, and another blueprint. There's another little valley down here. I don't think we've been down here either. What the hell is going on? There's just stuff everywhere. Nothing here though. Open wrecks. <gasps> there is stuff here. There is stuff here. Sulfur in, I think. Take that. Take that cloth. Now, uh, what else can we take? Another Tusker seed would probably be good. Well, there we go. There's another wreck down here as well. That is in, and I didn't, I didn't realize that you could actually open them either. We've got that chip on us. Oh, we've got to find out what that chip, what that chip does. Let's go and find out what that chip does. Here we go. Uh, here. Will it unlock anything? Jetpack T3. Really? We've got a T2 at the moment. What do we need for a jetpack T3? Oh my god, I need one. I need one. Uh, T2, T3. Uh, two explosive, two osmium, and a T2 jetpack. We can do that. Two. And we've got two explosives over here. Oh, we're running low on that. And uh, we need to get that off as well. Here we go. T3. Beautiful. All right, that's going to help a lot as well. 
throw that in there. So we now have propulsion plus 190. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool indeed. All right, so what do we need? We need a mutagen and we need a... Uh, we need another tree bark and we needed a mutagen and... Uh, which is going to require bacteria. So we need two bacteria samples, which is going to be six algae. Now we are also going to get breathable atmosphere in this as well, which is pretty exciting. Which kind of makes makes sense, you know, once you've terraformed and stuff like that, then uh, and the atmosphere has changed, then you should, if you've got a, an atmosphere that's, uh, that's, that's well... Well, I mean, I might be wrong. I might be completely and utterly wrong. But if you've got an atmosphere that is um uh that is capable of growing trees and stuff like that then the chances are that uh you should be able to breathe in that atmosphere as well uh what the hell am i looking for water i'm looking for water guys i knew i was looking for something i'll head back down here grab this out are we there and we'll grab all of that we'll make these two we'll make the mutagen Da, 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 put the lab a little bit closer. And we need one methane cartridge, uh, which we've got in there. Thank you very much. We've got to keep collecting our methane as well. Uh, we'll make one mutagen. And now... Oh, is that a storm coming through? Yes, it is. Look at that storm rolling through. Holy crap. Okay, so we've got our super alloy. We've got our mutagen. I uh, can't remember what else it was. Let's try this backpack. Oh, this backpack goes a lot faster. <gasps> Lovely. Food level low. We wanted to do a biomass rocket. So we need one fertilizer and one more super alloy and a lerma. Right, here we go. One biomass rocket, thank you. Perfect. And off she goes. Off she goes, guys. Up to space to spread some more biomass. Lovely. And hopefully bring us some more green as well. Alright, I am leaving this episode here, guys. I hope that you guys have enjoyed this episode as per usual. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, thank you so much for all the support and stuff that you that you guys have given me on this. Because honestly, it's uh, it's it's magnificent. I, I really, really, really appreciate it, guys. Uh, I will see you all the next episode. What the hell were I was I making all of that shit for? Huh. I have no idea. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. Bye. Oh, no, before you go, everything's getting green. I reckon we're going to have a, uh, a big media. No, everything's getting green because that rocket's working. And spreading biomass. See you next time. Bye, guys.